investigation has decided to not recommend the impeachment of South Dakota Attorney General Jason Roundsburg. Kevin Santella joins us live now from the South Dakota State Capitol with a recap of the committee's decision. Good evening, Dan. Bridget, back in 2020, Roundsburg was behind the wheel of a car that struck and killed pedestrian Joe Beaver. The House committee voted along party lines six to two. The majority of the select committee hereby concludes Attorney General Roundsburg did not commit an impeachable offense in his conduct surrounding the death of Joe Beaver. The select committee recommends that the articles of impeachment do not issue. Speaker of the House and Chairman of the committee, Spencer Gosh, says representatives will gather in 13 days. Any pair of representatives can bring forward articles of impeachment. Gosh expressed pride in the House select committee's work. Uh, I think they were very extensive in, in their work. They took their time and they left no stone unturned. So very proud of what they've done. Um, it's up to the individual member to make their own decision. Representatives Ryan Schwach and Jamie Smith, both Democrats, opposed the decision to not recommend impeachment. Smith is running for governor. The six votes in opposition to theirs came from Republicans. We, we believe that um, there were uh, there were problems with the testimony of the attorney general and not testimony because he never had to testify. I guess it was during his re reporting process there with the with his interrogations. Following the meeting, Kelloland News spoke with Beaver's cousin, Nick Nemec. Hardly a day goes by where you don't think about Joe and and some days more than others. And I just feel like we didn't. We didn't get justice for Joe Beaver. The attorney general eventually faced three misdemeanor charges related to his driving, but not Beaver's death. The careless driving charge was dropped in a plea deal. His attorney entered a plea of no contest on his behalf to charges of driving outside the lane and operating a motor vehicle while using a mobile electronic device. Tonight, South Dakota Governor Kristi Noem's re-election campaign has sent out a statement which reads in part, quote, the full house will have the opportunity in the coming days to correct the failures of this committee, close quote. Reporting live in Pierre, Dan Centella, Kelloland News. All right, thanks, Dan. Tribal leaders